Hi, my name is Gabby Chung, and I'm here from the Golden Rice Project. You probably know me because I'm quite famous. Now, as an NGO, our organization is trying to reach out to you, the general public, and make you aware of our efforts to revolutionize and aid this vitamin A deficient world. Through our genetically modified golden rice, we hope to take this global and severe problem and throw it out the window. More on that later though. Let's check out vitamin A deficiency. Vitamin A, a fat soluble vitamin stored in the liver. It can be found in many sources. Carrots, mangoes, spinach, cantaloupe, milk, egg yolks, cheese, liver, sweet potatoes, etc. Vitamin A deficiency, or VAD for short, has been a problem for years. The World Health Organization estimates about 250 million people suffer from VAD, and this generally affects children and pregnant women. VAD symptoms include blindness, lowered immunity, death, and xerophthalmia, a condition where the human eye fails to produce tears. And guys, what kind of world is it where you can't even cry? That's terrible. But what's that I hear? The Golden Rice Project coming to the rescue? You got that right. for that wonderful introduction. Now that we know about VAD, it's time to hear the solution. Golden rice. Our biochemically engineered golden rice is a variety of the Orzia sativa rice. Naturally, rice produces beta carotene, a precursor for vitamin A production in the leaves of the plants. However, the part we eat, the endosperm or the grain, does not contain beta carotene because photosynthesis does not take place there. Golden rice has been modified with phytine synthase and phytine desaturase genes so that beta carotene accumulates in the endosperm. Yum! So why rice? Why not some other product? Well, my friend, you underestimate rice. Not only is it cheap and abundant, but it's also a staple food for most developing countries around the world. This means that over 80% of what people eat in places like Southeast Asia and Africa is rice and, respectively, nothing but rice. Africa and Southeast Asia alone have over an estimated 125 million people suffering from VAD. These regions have become our priority, which is why the creators of Golden Rice Technology and Syngenta, a crop protection company, have donated this technology for humanitarian use in developing countries. Absolutely free. You're not convinced yet? Oh, I get it. You're all scared of those words. Genetically modified. But don't be. You see, we've done many tests and trials, and we haven't seen anything too crazy yet. With our new strand of genetically modified rice, called Golden Rice 2, we have reinforced our grains with even more beta carotene to produce even more vitamin A. With that new strand, we have seen successful results in human beings that this technology actually works. Do you believe golden rice is the solution to VAD problems in foreign countries? Well, golden rice alone won't eliminate the problem, but it will make a huge impact. People claim golden rice will lower crop diversification as well as take focus away from other important issues. Yes, but those people are wrong. You see, rice is already the most abundant crop in the regions that we're looking at. And what we're essentially trying to do is provide a substitute because the rice that they're eating right now is essentially nutrientless. So we want to all offer a healthy alternative that can be good in the long run as well as act as sustenance. And also, since we are an NGO, other important issues, they are important, but they're also not our concern. It's up to their governments to implement things that will help their society such as better education and uh, poverty relief. Well said, Gabby Chung. Well said.
Thanks for watching. Have a great day. A swell day. A super swell day. The swellest day of your life. Bye!